And here comes one of the most decorated competitors in WWE history. An A-lister of sports entertainment. The following is a triple threat match. Making his way to the ring from Hollywood, California, weighing in at 221 pounds, The Miz. Well, the one thing we do know about The Miz is that he is living his childhood dream, being a WWE superstar, and he has redefined what it means to be a WWE superstar. Finally, put a little respect on his name, Saxton. Miz is a reality TV icon, a movie star, Grand Slam champion two times over, WrestleMania headliner. Oh, and he's the it couple with Maurice. Here comes Finn Balor. A man who has truly embraced his darkness and has seen success as a result. And his opponents, first representing the Judgment Day from Bray County, Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 190 pounds, Finn Balor. The Prince has arrived and is more lethal than ever. Hey, a sense of pure animosity to him. Well, it's just the fact that Finn Balor's finally been able to free himself of any limitations WWE or the WWE fans have placed upon him. Yeah, well, I guess freeing himself of said limitations also translates into turning his back on the entire WWE Universe. Well, Boo-hoo, Byron. The results speak for themselves. Well, he attacks the body and the mind. The mark of a truly intelligent competitor. And oh, how he has developed a long, sadistic streak. I completely agree, Cole, and I completely enjoy it. The undeniable Cody Rhodes is back. And ready to stake his claim atop WWE. Weighing in at 220 pounds, the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes! Yeah. Multiple tag team and intercontinental championship reigns during his first run here in WWE. But now that the prodigal son has returned, Cody Rhodes has reached main event status. Certainly an accomplished career his first time around. Well, many would say this version of Cody Rhodes is completely transformed and set to take over the main event picture of WWE.
In this one, you've got to keep an eye out for any of these superstars taking advantage of the stipulations because triple threat rules are in play in this match with The Miz, Finn Balor, and Cody... Uh-oh. Out right present, and he breaks the submission. Hooked up. DDT. Able to interrupt the attack. Gets him with the counter. What a four up. Oh, man. He gets sent down to the floor. Uh oh. Jawbreaker. Call the dentist. This is it. Strong kick out late into the match. It's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left in the tank. If I've said it once, I've said it a thousand times. In a triple threat match, you absolutely have to keep your head on the swivel. You can't just focus on... Connor Rowe going for the win! Others are down for the victory! Balor retaliates. And it bears with a chop block. Being carried around with ease. Check your face after that one. The Miz hot dogging right now. That's nothing new. All right, back to it. Returning to the ring. Now he's been put on the defensive. It kicks from the A-lister. And the cover for the win. This is it. Bam! Down he goes. With authority. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Nothing fancy, but very effective. And Cody didn't see that coming. Man, oh right. my God, what a forearm! Excellent job. Valor looking to close this one out. Down 19 16. Cody is locked in the. O'Connor This could be it. He breaks the ref's count after one. Oh, come on! That's a vile chop block. And he's taking this to the outside now. Fighting back with a counter. Heads out and he has all the time he wants. Fight is so close to our announce table. Yeah, I'm just gonna step aside now. Hey, wait for me! What impact! And attacking above the shoulders has become the strategy here. Any more hits in that area could leave him dizzy. Everyone needs to get out of the way of this fight. This feels so unsafe. And a well-executed move we just saw there. Heading back to the ring. He's looking for something. This could... Now we're looking for lift up. Look at Those eyes look glazed over. Cover! Side headlock applied. Oh, and a right hand for good measure. He can end it here. He's got him. They kick out at only one. All the punishment he's taken, and yet he's still in this match. Here it comes. Skull crushing finale. The Miz had him measured. Two. Right now, I just don't know what it's going to take. The Miz almost tried to appeal to the official there, but he needs to take that energy and focus on ending this. Up for the electric chair, down for the drop. And that was a successful bit of offense with that maneuver. The springboard attack fails to land. Now that's a bell ringer. Oh, come on now. The Miz is being reprehensible. He's doing a whole lot of gesturing, and it could cost him. Oh. A Sayo suplex. Just vicious. What height! That was coming in hot at breakneck speed. Going fast and living dangerously. Drop kick to the knee. Oh. Whip back into the ring. Drop kick to the knee. Drop kick. Off the turnbuckles. What's he gonna do? 
Take off. He returns to the ring. And that was taking the attack to the competition with that one. And that was an effective attack, guys. Reversal. Can he take advantage? Oh, disabling the leg with that. Springboard misses the target. Hold up from behind. This could be it. Drops the hammer. Right on the lower back. Neck breaker. And it's Balor, who looks like he's a little worse for wear after that hit. After lasting this long in a triple threat, it'd be a shame to take a nosedive now. It's been an elacious encounter thus far. The tides have swung in multiple directions. It's anyone's guess how this one's gonna end. Sure, he's pumping himself up, but he's also giving his opponent a chance to recover. Fishing for something beneath the ring. Shades of the old EC dub as a kendo stick is introduced to the proceedings. Coming back into the ring, back to the action. Oh, low drop kick right on the patella. If this works, it could change the course of the match. And he cuts bait, soaring. Look out below! You want to talk about putting it all on the line. Always an extra risk when you dive ringside. Miz doing what he does best and worming his way into the head of his opponent. And that was taking the attack to the competition with that one. Square by the Haymaker. Up for the electric chair, down for the drop. Set up for the Russian oh. leg sweep. Nicely done. Oh. Oh, man, meeting the barricade. Holy, meet the barricade. Oh, and he slammed his face right into the barricade. And Finn heads him off at the pass. And returning to the ring. He must be asking himself of continuing his worth. And is the pain too much? Well, he's endeavored so much thus far. I guarantee he won't quit right now. And there was some force on that move. Kick to the abdomen. For the pin and the win. Yes. And he breaks up the count. Beautiful O'Connor roll for the victory. I think it's over. No, the Miz is still alive. Oh, come on now. The Miz is being reprehensible. Taking this outside. This could be good. Whoa, right into a chop block. Debilitating counter. He gets back into the ring. Kendo stick impact. Crafty way to get out of harm there. Great strength being shown here. Oh my goodness. And we just saw some serious offense. Boom! A forearm smash. Basement drop kick finds the mark. And Finn Balor connected nicely there. Rocked his opponent. And over the top into a rough landing. With a small bit back. Balor's capturing momentum now. A series of disabling maneuvers from Finn. Shot to the back, softening him up. Oh, this, this could be dangerous. This could hurt. Oh! German suplex! Treating the torso to yet another attack. He could pin his opponent right here. thought that was three. Shutting that down with the back elbow. Cody looking to wrap this one up. Oh, face first. Miz with the snap mare. Miz hit the ropes. Big boot. Gets inside the ring. This arena has come unglued. You can feel the foundation shifting with every turn of the match. Ooh, sharp elbow. Ooh. Lands the elbow. Oh, 
shot right to the kidney. Oh. And again. Great way to wear down your opponent. Blow. And Miz now finding himself on the wrong side of momentum. Miz needs to rely on his resourcefulness. Finn Balor to the top rope. Finn Balor up top. Good across from Balor. Finn got all of it. Broken up. And the match continues. That's teamwork. And Miz gets stopped in his tracks. Climbs back inside. What a forearm. Extraordinary offense from Balor. Finn is reaching that other level. Drop kick right to the knee. Right on the patella. Eyes in the drop zone. Good ground spot by Balor. That has got to be the one. Two. Got it. Survived the triple threat match. Those three superstars laid it all on the line, as we can see right here in these clips. Here is your winner, Finn Balor! Tremendous victory in this triple threat match. This was an unpredictable one, but when it was all said and done, only one man could be left standing. One man out of three, it was always bound to lead to a little chaos.